हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम अगेन इन आवर क्लास ऑफ इंग्लिश ग्रामर फॉर ट्वेल्थ इन प्रीवियस क्लासेस वी हैव ऑलरेडी स्टार्टेड आवर टॉपिक मॉडल्स एंड वी डिस्कस्ड अबाउट द यूज ऑफ शेल एज एंड विल इन टूडेज क्लास वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट आवर नेक्स्ट पॉइंट यूज ऑफ वुड वेयर कैन वी यूज वुड In which situation we use wood? So first of all, point first. Past sense of will in indirect speech we use wood. In indirect speech, past sense of will. Example, he told me that I would go to Mumbai. He told me that. It means it is indirect sentence. After changing narration, we use here would he would go to Mumbai. Next is Mohan told me that he would not do that work. Told me that here is second form told. So we use here would in place of will. He would not work. Would not do that work. Next is to show. the past habit of an action past habit of an action we use would example gandhi ji would spin for hours gandhi ji would spin for hours he would often study till ne- till late in the night he would often study till late in the night next is point third to express wish that not completed wish such type of wish that did not complete that had not completed and for this we only do wish example would that i were a big bird would that i were a big bird next is would that i were a hard worker would that i were a hard worker in this sense before that we use here would and after subject we use were in place of was or in place of any other helping verb we use here were with any type of pronoun next is to show preference or rather before rather than we also use would and to show preference also we use would example i would like to have a cup of tea yeah i would have like to have coffee i would like to have coffee i would rather starve than beg rather than beg we use here would in direct way before rather and then we use only would our next point of would with improbable condition in the past sense in improbable in probable condition here in case of if the condition of if with second form we also use would example if he worked hard he would pass he if he worked worked is second form so we here use would if he walked fast he would catch the bus next point next point is polite request to show polite request we also use would example would you lend me your bicycle for an hour would you move a bit please would you move a bit please in both cases in polite request we use would next is 
यूज ऑफ कैन यूज ऑफ कैन फेयर और विच कंडीशन वी यूज कैन मॉडल्स कैन सो फर्स्ट पॉइंट इज टू एक्सप्रेस द मेंटल और फिजिकल एबिलिटी कैपेसिटी एंड पावर वी यूज कैन टू एक्सप्रेस द मेंटल एंड फिजिकल एबिलिटी कैपेसिटी एंड पावर वी यूज कैन एग्जाम्पल आई कैन सोल्व दिस सम मेंटल एबिलिटी सोल्व दिस सम कैन आई कैन लिफ्ट दिस हैवी बॉक्स फिजिकल एबिलिटी आई कैन लिफ्ट दिस हैवी बॉक्स नेक्स्ट इज कैन यू स्पीक इंग्लिश कैन यू स्टैंड ऑन योअर हैड कैन यू स्टैंड ऑन योअर हैड इज ऑल्सो डेरोगेटिव नेक्स्ट इज नेक्स्ट पॉइंट पॉइंट टू फॉर टेकिंग और गिविंग इन फॉर्मल परमिशन we use can example you can go home if you have done your work in formal condition we use may but in informal condition we use can can i use your dictionary can i use your dictionary next to express possibility with any time anyone anywhere to show possibility example death can come any time death can come any time next is he can reach here any time next more example he can go anywhere he want next is use of could modals could here there are two points to express or to use of could first is past sense of can in indirect speech past sense of can in it means where in direct speech we use can in indirect speech we use could example rohit said that he could solve that problem rohit said that he could solve that problem next is he asked me if i could help him he asked me if i could help him next is second point to express past past ability or capacity we use could in the sense of past example i could swim when i was young i could run fast when i was young next is she could solve the sum when she was only 5 years these are the sentences of past ability that's all thank you